Am I blind? <laughs> this is the best costume in the game, dude. Brave boy, best boy. Holy God, that was like the best ending of all time. That was like the best ending of all time. <laughs> all right, guys, this is the Pinnacarl of Laurel design <laughs> by Tim Butt. <laughs> not, not just Tim, Tim Butt. All right, let's go. <sighs> let's go. Well. Oh, do I have more shinies? More shinies! More! More? More? Okay. That was... That was, I had to get my shinies out of the way. Wait, did I get hit? What hit me? <laughs> I don't think I could stop that. <laughs> Tim Butt is some Tim Butt too. <laughs> oh! I made it. Oh! I lost it. How did the shell get through here? Where did the shell come from? Did the shell go through the wall? Where did the shell come from? <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, well, there's nowhere else to go and I don't know what to do. Help. Oh, I can get a helmet. Wait, 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 wait. I'm trying to scroll the screen. Scroll the screen. Shoot, damn it! <laughs> Whoa, that's really cool. Okay, oh. <laughs> this is the best. This is the best fucking costume in the game, dude. Let's go! <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right. Anyway, uh, most of the time people do it with bumpers these days. That was the best way that I found. All right. I think we do that. And then that? I want this costume. No! Give me the costume! Oh. <laughs> it caught on fire. No, that's right. Fish, fish when they like dip in the lava become flaming fish? Completely forgot about that. All right, I think there's nothing that we can do to keep that costume, which is sad. <laughs> okay, don't want to keep the helmet. Don't want to keep the helmet. What is that from? What is that thing from? Alright. No! Get the fuck out. Okay. I should just... This looks... I don't... I don't think this can troll me. It can troll me. <laughs> Alright. I think we just do a big jump. No! No! The, what? Is that a fake one? I can't tell. One of these is gonna be fake. Oh, I didn't go fast enough. I got way too scared. <laughs> I think it just baited me into going slow. All right, you guys are getting promotions. It's gonna fuck me, but how? All right, I think let's. <laughs> so is that the only troll? I think it is. All right, what the fuck do I do? <gasps> oh no! <laughs> oh no, I needed to go before the... Before the spring got pooted onto that. Oh, the arrows kind of tell you to jump there. Why do you bother getting the power, but you just lose the helmet instead? Uh... I'll tell you when I die. Or realize that I'm dumb when I die. What does that say? Does that say something? I feel like that says something. Oh, maybe not. It's just eyes or something. Okay, what are we? <gasps> <laughs> oh, I was like, maybe I'll hit this. <sighs> oh god. Oh my god. How am I alive? That must have been so close to killing me. <gasps> go, 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 go! Get out of the car box. It's gonna shoot. No, it's. 
There's a checkpoint back there. Is there a mushroom under this? Can you... You can either somehow YOLO jump that, or there's a mushroom under this. There was no mushroom under this. Okay, how do I not die? Alright, we just wait a sec here on this shit. Is it triggered when I get close? Yeah, I think it's triggered when I get close. So, how do I do this part? What's up with that? What else do I do? Not that! <laughs> suppose let's find out. Nah, there's no way. What else do I do? What's- that's doing something, but I don't know what. Hold on, am I blind? I don't see anything else to do here. <laughs> oh, oh, that's a CP1. That's a fucking CP1 if I've ever seen one. What are those donuts doing up there? What are those donuts doing? Also, where did they go? Where did they go? Where did they go? There's like a vine under that. Ooh, I want that booty. Let's go. That. Oh, what? It. It can do that. Oh, be <gasps> it died! Oh no! <laughs> oh no! <sighs> Why did I think that was gonna work? There was no way that was ever gonna work. So when it gets red and angry, hot, it ooh, it goes faster, and that lets it like jump up to that other one. What's this? Okay, bottom one. Oh. <laughs> Okay, what's that? Why is there a cloud? Let's go left this time? Yeah. This is fine. <gasps> it's not fine. <laughs> Damn it. Pretty sure left is the only- yeah, I don't think I can do anything else there. <sighs> oh, and when I go over here, the one way will now let me go through it. Yeah, see now I can go through the one way. That's so weird. Alright. like that setup. This is- Makes me think I want to jump up, but I'm suspicious. <gasps> Shit. Yo, hi Stellar Strix. I really enjoyed watching your playthrough of my level. Oh, this is gonna fuck me. So much for being a brave boy. Brave boy, activate! Oh, brave! Brave boy, best boy! Blip! 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 Brave boy, best boy! Brave boy! Yeah, I got a checkpoint! Let's fucking go! Brave boy, best boy! Brave boy, dead boy. Alright, well, I feel like we made some progress. Let's try going... not this way. <gasps> donuts! Oh god, I'm scared of donuts because donuts equals CP1. I don't think I wanted to do that. What's that gonna do? Oh, I thought I might get in the boot. What's this? What is this whole area down? Oh, it's just a death? What's the point of that? Huh. I don't think I get the point of that. Maybe I can get the boot? I don't... There's like, I feel like there's a way to get that boot, but I don't know what it is. I think I'm... I think this is like the contraption to kill me for when I fuck this section up. How am I gonna get that boot? Do I get the... Maybe I release the Goomba... F Goomber. No, where's the... What? Oh, let's stand right under this. That didn't do anything. What am I doing? <laughs> what if we hit it and then go over here? See, look, now it comes at me. Do I want that? No, 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 no. What do I use the Goomba for? I don't know what I did, though. <laughs> Okay, if I if I just hit the boot and let it walk, it will get me the Goomba. But what do I I don't even know. I'm super blind right now, guys. I don't even It's gotta be able to do something for me. Oh what does it do for me? 
What do I do with that? I'm dumb. I'm dumb. Uh. Oh my god, I'm an idiot. It gives me the boost. If I, I was like, what do I do with the Goomba? I don't want the Goomba. I want the boot. Okay, step one, be bad. Step two... <gasps> Why does it jump up there?! Hold on. Will it damn it? Will it kill me? If it comes out here, will it... Why do I do?! Can I hit... Is it with this block somehow? Oh, maybe it's like this. <laughs> I get it! I get it! Do I have to jump? I think I have to jump. Where do I go? Okay. I could go the other way, too. Let's just try this door. I don't think that's the way I go. Let's try going up here. What? Do I want that? What's the point of that? Wait. Oh. <sighs> Not like this. Okay. Oh, this is- that's why this exists! I don't think I go that way yet. <laughs> Wait, do I- I do go in the door. Only smart boy, brave boy. God, I thought for sure that, that was gonna be a CP1 or something. <gasps> no! <laughs> no! Oh, it baited me so hard. And then I think I just uh, wait like right, <gasps> like right here. No, not there! Oh, I didn't think it pushed you up. I think I just don't die here, but that's confusing. Yeah, I just don't die there. <laughs> I'm not hitting that. Did I need to hit that? Why did I just... What the fuck? Did we, just kill <laughs> we got some toasty buns. Do I really hit this? Oh. Oh, it pushes it up. <gasps> Whoa, that's cool. Okay, no spiky buns. Do I want that? Oh, can't fool me. <laughs> It made me lose my uh, grip, but I got it again. Okay. <gasps> nope. Okay, that's actually death down there. Yeah, that's actually death down there. That one's, that one's moving fast. Why is there an up arrow right there? Oh, to hold up to grab the vine. I get it. Okay. That's weird. So the donut lifts this up one. And then when it lifts it up one, it gets me gets me close enough to it to hit it. And then once I hit it, it sort of bounces off me. <laughs> okay. Lanky's climbing animation is hilarious. Ah, I see. Okay, so we need to do big boy jump. <laughs> no, that's <laughs> God damn it. Okay, you have to jump onto it later. What? I thought it only killed me because I ran into it from the side, but it actually kills you even when you're already bull. That doesn't make any sense, all right? Everybody knows that Mario's titanic ass is the strongest force in the universe. I should be able to slam it with my titanic ass and win. How does it, how does it win? That does not make any sense. It needs to be accelerating or else it doesn't exert any force. <laughs> Makes sense. Story checks out. That's. <gasps> I didn't. It, maybe I didn't wait long enough. What the? It's like there's a there's like a period of time in there where you like actually can't hurt it, and it can still destroy you. Okay, wait. It's it went up. All right, Jesus, that's so weird. Yeah, thanks for those subs. I will check them out as soon as I'm done. As soon as I go back to CP1 Kappa. <laughs> All right. No more spaghetti. Get some speed, dodge that one, jump off of that one. I can't go down the pipe, so we're going in the door. <laughs> no, the poop shoot! 
Let's see if he wants option. Oh God, dude, the training, the training. I got trained. I got trained, man. Especially when you, oh, you know, being. Now I can go in this one. Wait a minute. He really wants me to be big. What? <laughs> what the fuck was that? It was like pseudo twice twice. I ended up back here again. It's because I went in the top pipe. This setup right here, if you are small Mario, you can only go in the bottom pipe. See, right now, I can't go in this one. But if you're big Mario, you're like, you hit your forehead on the top of the other pipe or something, and you can't go in the bottom one, you can only go in the top one. <laughs> what was the troll here? I was brave boy here, so brave boy again. Brave boy, brave boy again. I don't remember what I did, but brave boy. Thank God, all right, we're back. Wait, Carl blind, what did I do? Oh God. What did I do? Oh no! Did I do something dumb? Oh no. Did I do something dumb? Oh no. <laughs> do you have to see V1? What? What's going on? Where do I go? <laughs> Was there nothing else to do? Oh, I'm not gonna make it. Oh shit. I'm gonna be here forever. Alright. Jump. Was this the spot? I think you have... Yeah, that's the same one. Do you have to do this? Do you have to do this and then you have to survive this section? And you have to make it here big to go in this... But how do you win? <laughs> Where do I go? What do I do? <laughs> what do I do? <laughs> oh, I go up here, don't I? I saw this. this is, no. Unfortunately, the stipulation on the end of that short level was me not being a dum-dum. You have to go. I want to know what happens if you don't go in this, though. Oh my god, because of the... That's so crazy! Because remember, there were two fucking piranhas right here the very first time, and I jumped into it. How the fuck does this setup work? Where the where are the piranha come from? <laughs> Cause that made me take damage, so I could never have done this until I went through the whole section. That's so cool, but how? Carl good? Oh, I am afraid you are mistaken about that. <laughs> you are very mistaken about that. I don't deserve that message. What the fuck was that? Is there another way to beat this? Oh! Oh! Oh, can this clip me in? Ah, I don't stop it! 
the mines do nothing there! <laughs> like the perfect oh it's be am i actually dead wait it's the flag suck it's the flag suck it's the flag suck remember the top of the flagpole flag suck flag suck strongest suck do i have to do the whole level again i don't think i can get through it no no! I can't do it! What's going on, dude? What's going on? Are you kidding me? Will this let me through somehow? Will this fucking... Fucking brilliant! Oh my god, dude! Holy god, that was like the best ending of all time! That was like the best ending of all time! <laughs> Flag suck it, rest of the world! <laughs> this setup is really interesting. Is this. Oh, this is like the contraption that flings me up. How does this fling you up? I don't actually know. Oh, wow! What? It knocks, look at this, it knocks this one up on top of this one. What the fuck is that? What the fuck is that? <laughs> what is the point of this? Does this have something to do with... I think that this setup right here has something to do with this thing pooping out. Because yeah, this setup, when you come here the first time... Oh no, this is not the same section. It's just made to look like it, isn't it? Never mind, this is not the same section. Him blocks left. Where are the him blocks? Oh, um. Or bad. Or <laughs> 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 <Her> bad. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. I'm bad. Yeah, I know. Shit. I feel like I missed a troll here. Yeah, if I had stood on top of these. It would have pooted me up here at some point, right? Maybe only when I approach from the side. Maybe only when I approach it like this. Why do those... Oh, wow. So how does that work? How does that work? Oh my gosh. When you hit this one... When you hit that one, it bounces under, breaks a block. Whoa! Releases the spring and it poots that up there. Also, what's the point of these flying blocks? You see these flying blocks right here? There's got to be a point of those, right? What does it do if you don't have... Oh, they don't! <gasps> you need that for them to... Oh, look at that! The, uh, the spinies, or spike top, um, won't stick to the one-way gate without that because they need some kind of solid ceiling and that doesn't count for it So that's why those are there. They make them stay upside down on these. Wow, that's really cool And then this totally trained me for later because this beetle I could bounce off of but the other one I couldn't bounce off of huh, That's really cool. I feel like there was probably something else here because the fucking arrows everywhere <gasps> Oh shit, so if you had... Wow, if I had stood too far over there, I would have gotten... See, right here the cannon doesn't show, but if I had if I had stood over here in my shiny box, I would have gotten screwed. Okay, oh, it's the clown car trick! Okay, so when you spawn in up here, the clown car with the thwomp in it makes the piranha plans go away. That means that if I were to go, to go away and then come back, I wonder if I can make this jump, but regardless of whether I can actually be good at platforming, let's not rely on that. Check it out. If I were to spawn in from up here, like I did when I got CP1, and collect that checkpoint, 
And then if I go over here and come back, I think the Prada plant. Yeah, see, look, now the Prada plants are there. So the way that the uh, the clown car thwomp trick works is right when you spawn in, it will despawn anything that's touching them. But if you run off screen and come back, then they will spawn. And so this door is positioned just far enough away to make it so that they see they do spawn in. This just goes to show you like how much positioning and stuff it really goes into a level like this. Like the level is set up to include the trolls, but it also has to like build around these these unique unique like camera tricks too to make stuff spawn in the right way. There's another hidden block message. Oh. I heart you CP2, but CP1 is too much fun. <laughs> Oh no, oh no, no oh, no. Uh, is this the first one? Oh, there's two of them here. Uh, so which one of these was... Oops, I didn't mean to go back in that door. Oh, this is the wrong one. Yeah, that's the one where I just grabbed the vine and then I have to go in the pipe. Oh, can you actually go in this pipe then? Okay, so there are hidden vines behind these clouds. If I could actually- why can't I- oh, because I'm not in the fucking editor. Ah! Ah! Yeah, okay, so there's a hidden vine behind that cloud, and that's what, like, sucks me up into that pipe. But would it have been possible- Oops. Would it have been possible to go in this pipe? It is. Wait, what? Is this a totally different section? What? Oh, no. No. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> uh, no. No, no. Okay, I think it's not possible, right? Yeah, it's not possible. Not possible unless we cheat! Unless we cheat! No. <laughs> Alright, fine. Fine then. Yeah, actually, if you guys- if you guys are craving more Garbo, Death Note in the Carl music box. We're gonna have- a, we're gonna have some music. Or is the only music going to be my screams of insanity? We shall see. Oh god. It's me- there's- that looks like music. Come back, music. <laughs> what? Is this gonna play the whole time? Okay, I can't go in that pipe. One stuns. Is this gonna play the whole time we do the level? <laughs> Are we just gonna be listening to this the whole time we play the level? I don't know if I want to hit anything, honestly. I didn't want to hit that. <laughs> I didn't want to hit that. <laughs> oh my god. I'm not hitting. That's gonna be the one I have to fucking hit, dude. That's gonna be the one I have to hit. Bye. See you later. What do I do? How do I hit that? How would I hit it from below? Oh, I get it. Oh, you do it like that. Okay, okay, okay. I don't know what I do with the Yoshi, but I think I get it. Oh. <laughs> what the fuck is that? I'm fucking bad. I need to do a big jump. Okay. Wait, I'm blind? Oh no, what am I blind? <laughs> oh no. Oh no, I don't see it. Oh no, I don't see it. Why can't I not do a big jump off of this? Why am I bad? Okay, there we fucking go. Give me Yashi. <gasps> oh! I could have just... I, wait, can I... I forget if you can... Can you duck on Yoshi like this? I can't even remember. No, I can't. I... <sighs> I didn't need the Yoshi. <laughs> I didn't even need him! I don't want to go in that. No! What? No! What? Why? Whoa! 
<laughs> Whoa, this is cool! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Okay, wait. I just do this. I'm actually an idiot. <laughs> no, dude! Well, I get to watch this again. <laughs> Wee! <laughs> Go up here instead. Small jump, get out of there. <laughs> What's this shit, though? Oh, the fish? They're not gonna. Oh! <gasps> Where are those coming from? This is so weird be because there's like track and shit everywhere. Oh, God. No. Ah! I think I have to do a running jump and hit that. I think that's what I wanted to do. Okay. And then I go in the pipe. I could have gone on top, maybe? Oh, man. Okay, and I, let's see if I can... Yeah, I, okay, I have to go in this. And then I have to get out of the fucking car box. Get me out, get me out, get me out, get me out. He's coming, he's coming, he's coming, he's coming! Oh, I'm alive! Get me out, get me out, get me out! No! Is it the bottom of that pipe, the top of that pipe, or somewhere, or do I go, or do I clip through the note block? Like, a lot of the people who make troll levels consistently for me have standards. <laughs> I remember, Ghost Egg is one of those, like, old school level creators where, like, you just get fucked. You just get fucked. <laughs> You just, you just get body 24-7. Okay, I think I need to like... It's not, I think I... I think I actually use the shell. Hold on, there's... The, the coins go here. No, that ain't it. I think I get what to do and it's... Clip through the music block, question mark? Or damage boost over? Maybe I could have damage boost over? Am I blind? Yeah, this level is a visual bag of dicks. I think I have to use it to clip through the music block. I don't know, though. So, I think the strat is like... I'm dead. Okay, here's this plan. Here's the plan. Okay. Here we go. <sighs> Why am I hitting things? I don't like any of this. Do I even want this? Probably not. No. What is that? Did I just get fucked because I didn't go fast enough? Oh, what the fuck is going on? <laughs> Got any more springs there? I think I'm bombed. Pretty sure I'm bombed. Oh, I figured out why there's springs in them. <laughs> Alright, but for right here, let's just go fast. Get through this section. I need to get up there. Get me the f No, 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 go in the fucking... <laughs> I don't even know if I can go in that pipe. I thought I I thought I hit it, but I hit this I got kind of on the side of it Okay, I still don't know where to go. It could be here. It's not there. I'm assuming that's death Okay, I just I literally just failed to go in the oh, thank god. Oh, thank god <laughs> I had to do another room Well, I thought I was doing something cool. <laughs> I might need another shell and then throw the other shell in there. Uh, by the way, if you guys haven't seen, uh, if you haven't checked out Snowberry's stream, she's actually an amazing streamer. Just super, super fun, really positive. Um, can we get a link to Snowberry's stream? Okay, I think we do it like this. <laughs> We're gonna be here a while. We're gonna be here a while. Do I need that big Yoshi? I don't actually know if I need that big Yoshi. Oh god! Get me! I don't want to die! I'm scared! No! Give me a Yoshi! Come back! Come back, motherfucker! Come back! Oh god. I think I needed that Yoshi. Holy shit! Was that- so was that all bait or did I need the Yashi? Because I didn't see where these munchers came from. Well, I don't know if I needed the ashes or not. I might have needed the ashes. Oh, because I could uh, I could grab the springs, but I don't know. Oh, well, 
Oh, fuck you. <sighs> Why is it so tight? Oh my gosh, yeah, I am. <laughs> I am beyond hype about Mario Maker 2 for both the trolls and the regular levels. I just, I want to do everything. All right, wait, no, this is good. This is good. This is good. I'm... <laughs> There's like a... What? Was it the ice? I don't... I'm just bad. I don't... Blah, blah, blah. Okay, we're gonna do this, and then... Yeah, that does... No, wait, we don't want it. We, we don't want it. We didn't want it. We could have just proceeded. No, it was a mistake. It was a mistake. <laughs> just like playing this level! <laughs> <sighs> well, at least I'm getting a little better at that. You have to do like a low control jump. I need to just dodge this. Yeah, and then we can just go down here. And probably it's the... Probably it's the top path? He's probably gonna troll me. Let me just sneak in the gap. Yeah, I think I, you know what, I think I actually did it right. I think I actually did it right. There's nothing up here, right? Just to be sure. I don't think so. Pretty sure there's nothing up there. Okay. All right, this is hopefully right. Yo, welcome, Ricky. How do I get out of here? Change my mind, chat. <laughs> Gets better, I told you earlier. Uh, uh, unfortunately, we're just gonna go in here and get bodied again. I think. Like, how do I not... Maybe it's... That was it. That's cool. Down. There's a checkpoint. I could make that jump, but let's go over to the right. Uh, going to the right might be a troll, though. Hold on. I don't want to hit this music block until I have to. I can't go up there. So that was just very confusing because of all the blocks everywhere. Do I go to the left? No, I don't go to the left because there's fucking spikes everywhere over there. Alright, well we gotta do this. Okay, that was fucking sick. That was fucking sick! What the hell was that? <laughs> okay, maybe it gets better. Maybe it gets better. Ghost Sagan is like a connoisseur of ridiculous, amazing Mario tricks. <laughs> so I was expecting some new tech. Oh, I. Woo okay. And then I think we just have to jump at the. Oh! I think I just jump in the box, right? And then it'll land me over there. I'm glad we're moving towards the insane music phase of Mario Maker Troll levels. Okay. Uh... <sighs> this is my life now. This is my fucking life now. <laughs> Whee! All right, we gotta just go. Somewhere I get a shell. Oh, what do you want from me? Is it the Yoshi eggs? See ya. Oh, I just need to... Can I not make this jump, though? I can make this jump, right? Oh, come on, dude. <laughs> come on! No! They, like... It's like one fucking pixel. Can you- wait, but you can get variable jump height off of these. I know, you can get variable jump height off of these. Oh, is it not- is there no possible one? Spin. Uh. Uh. I don't think I can make it. Uh, maybe the momentum would help too, I don't know. I don't think I can make it. Cause I got- I'm getting lower jumps now than I was. 
If I can't get that Yoshi, I'm gonna lose my mind. All right, give me the fucking checkpoint. Get me out of this fucking level. We got the music block. Let's go. Clearly, it's gonna get better from here. Obviously, Z. Woo! Uh, all right. Looks like I hit it to the other way. And something, something. Spin jump, bomb, mega double dick. What the hell? That was cool. Okay, I think I do that, but then don't suck. I don't think I can go back. Yeah, I don't think I can go back. Guaranteed. Guaranteed. This is the part that gets better. It's a cool setup. Uh, I need to land on the other side of the bomb, and then I think I want the bomb to go to the right, but I don't actually know. That might just be a troll, because something will either come out of the music block on the bottom, or I'll just get fucked. One or the other. I keep hitting it the wrong way. I think I needed I think I needed it to go here. Yeah, I did need it to go there. Uh, there we go. Sprang jump. Oh god. No. I needed that Yoshi, I think. Or maybe not. I mean I don't even fucking knows. I don't actually need to spring jump this do I? Oh no I do. Yeah, it's not quite high enough otherwise. This music is just enough to make you crazy. I could potentially have a Yoshi here. Don't want to be in that top right area. Oh god. I don't think I want to be hitting those. Maybe I do though. Hold on. Do I want to hit any of those blocks? Or just piece the fuck out? It's a puzzle level, guys. Carl loves puzzles. Isn't this a nice puzzle level? Well, I can actually go in it. No. Do we ride down the dick chute or do we hit those? I'm just gonna ride the dick shoot. I'm just going. Where's this? God damn, I got scared! I just jumped, I jumped, I got scared! I got scared. No, these things block you if you don't go fast enough. Oh, I almost went right down that. I don't think I need to actually get the Yoshis. I'm just avoiding all this shit. Right. I think we can just safely peace out. What is that section? I might have dodged a bullet here, so we're gonna just assume that all of this is garbage. Get me out of the garbage lair. So what's the way to not suck at this part? How do I not die? Oh, I can... I swear, I was- it just happened at the same time! I was gonna hit the question mark block! I was gonna hit the question mark block! Fuck off. Okay. Go away. WHAT IS THIS?! Get me out of here. No! No! <laughs> My god, it's like a broken spine. Oh, I don't. That was almost really bad. <laughs> almost got the big suck. So, this is actually a really cool setup. I want to see how this works, because I feel like you could actually use this in a good level instead of in this garbage. <laughs> I 
We're just gonna hit this fast? That doesn't do anything! It doesn't do anything! Maybe something will happen? I'm just gonna hide. Expand dong, let's go. Oh shit. Well, I failed. Alright, we're just gonna go. Oh. My god! I don't wanna hit that, but I don't think I have a choice. Oh god, the fire's coming. Oh, what is this? What? How do I get in there? Oh! oh my god, this, get me out of here. Get me out! Please be the end. Please be the end. Oh, I need to hold right. I need to hold right. I think I get it. I think I get it. I think it's an auto section and I hold right. I think it's just... I think it's just hold right. But do I hold right and run or just right? Wow, what? Gosegan says you hold down? This fucking right arrows, motherfucker. Gosegan says you hold down. All right, now I have to navigate the blues. Oh, I didn't see the top one. I think I should just run. Auto till it's not. More like notto. So all those booth circles are up before I can really do anything about it. Oh god, this is a nightmare. Cause no! I saw the other one coming, so I was... Oh, no, dude! No, this ending sucks! This ending sucks! Oh. Okay, first cycle, best cycle. First cycle, best cycle. Don't fuck me. Don't fuck me. Please, please, please! Oh, thank God! Oh, thank God! There's. Was that actually CV1? Was that actually CV1? Oh my God! I need to go see if that was actually gonna CV1 me. You don't think Go Sega to CV1s? Yeah. Oh, I started! Oh, oh God! I started! No, that's the fucking number one feature that they need to put in. Um, they they need to put in Mario Maker 2 is the ability to unstar levels. <laughs> Okay, wait, what would've happened? What would've happened if we didn't Cosmic Brain going back into that? Oh boy. It's actually a fucking CP1, dude! <laughs> well, that was a really, really confusing mixture of awesome music sections, terrible platforming, absolute jank, dick bag trolls, and extremely creative setups. <laughs> What do you think should be the largest change of the current school system? I mean, not having a one-size-fits-all solution where you cram everybody through a small bottleneck with a whole bunch of shitty tests that everybody has to learn all sorts of crap that they're probably never gonna use for the entire rest of their fucking life and actually letting people explore, try different things. They don't have to succeed at every single thing. Like it just, the entire system makes no goddamn sense to me. And it's not like that everywhere too. Like I went to, I gave it, now you got me mad. I gave a talk at a private school and it was like they had journalists, politicians, scientists, everybody coming in and talking to the kids in like almost like a small group setting that's like, hey, this is what it's like to be a journalist. And I came in and I was like, this is what it's like to be a scientist. And I just like, it, 
Imagining if every school actually had fucking resources to do things, to actually show people what the world is like, to show them what careers are like. Like, if you take an English class, how does that tell you what being any job is gonna actually be like? And there's so many different careers out there that have nothing to do with any of those classes to begin with. Like, taking science classes has very little to do with being a scientist, but there are a lot of jobs and careers that are even far more removed than that. So how are you gonna know what you wanna do with your life when you're just sitting there fucking taking tests? All the school does is it teaches you how to memorize shit and how to take tests. And those are skills that are useful for some people, for some jobs, sometime, but not for everybody always, and not just not at all for a whole lot of shit. So, and like, I, I wish that people had options, lots of options. Like, if I'm succeeding super fast in a class, why do I have to sit there, you know, bored out of my mind for the next 700 years for the rest of the class? I think self-study should be encouraged and useful. Like, I think if anybody wants to, and they wanna just go and drill through online classes, they should be able to do that test out of a class, whatever, and peace the fuck out instead of wasting your life, you know, going through year after year after year of public education garbage. And like, while I was at this public school, like, they had like, art stuff set up outside, like kids could just do whatever they wanted. And I was just like, why is this only for rich people? You know, why, is, why do only rich people get to have access to all of these cool things? And it's just like, why is this not like a basic human right for everybody? It just, it makes no goddamn sense. It makes no goddamn sense. The way that it's set up makes, anyway, that was a giant fucking rant. <laughs> if I had money, I would send my kid to a private school in an instant. And that makes me sad. That makes me sad that not everybody can do that. It makes perfect sense. Don't you remember schools mostly about doing well on standardized tests? Dude, yeah, exactly. Exactly, I just, and I get that there needs to be like standards to some extent, you know, like universities need to know who to admit, jobs need to judge people for whatever, but I, even that I don't buy, even that I don't buy. Okay, so I have trained probably, yeah, over 20 students now, I have had be an intern in my lab. There is almost no correlation between students who are like A plus students who do well in all their classes and those who do well in an actual lab because a lab is hands on. It's not about reading a book and having the book tell you what to do. It's not about memorizing stuff. Those skills can be useful, but those are not the deciding skills that make you a successful scientist or a successful researcher. I was fucking garbage at school. I hated studying. I hated memorizing stuff. I still do. You know, and I turned out great in terms of being a decent scientist. So it's just the skills that you learn in school are not the skills that you need to succeed in a lot of different careers, science included. And science is probably one where it still probably even helps you, but there's other ones where it doesn't. So I don't fucking know, man. Oh, well, that's the thing too, like it's a problem with doctors, right? When, when doctors only know how to follow a formula, and they don't, you know, they don't actually think for themselves and they're going to make mistakes because it's, you know, they're going to, what's right for most people is not right for everybody. But yeah, private schools provide a better education, but only rich people can afford them. Exactly. But like, why? Why, you know, why, why as a country, as a world, do we not value educating our kids? Why is that not the most obvious thing for everybody to want to put their money into? It just doesn't make sense to me. Don't teach problem solving. Yeah, like those fundamental skills are the things that translate. Learning, you know, every other individual minute specific thing is not going to translate to anything. And it's like, it's totally fine to learn that stuff, but I don't, I just don't understand why that's the only thing you can do. Oh, anyway, I hope people who plan an organized education system would think, would think how you do. But the main problem is uh, you need to be there to understand it. And most people who are in charge aren't weren't there yeah and there's also like in general in society you know it has its pluses and its minuses but there's like you know a general societal trend where it's like oh well back in my day this is how it was and i turned out fine so then let's never fucking make anything better and to me that's like everybody should feel like everything that they went through and they should think about how to make it better so that not everybody has to, you know, constantly go through the same stuff for all of eternity. Like, just society is like in a giant fucking Carl box. <laughs>
Oh my God. Have you ever thought of becoming a teacher? I actually love teaching. I got into teaching in college. Well, TAing, which is like teaching lab classes for science. Um, literally because I was fed up with how crappy my teachers were. Because when I discovered science and how much I loved it and how different it was from school, I was like, it doesn't fucking have to be this way. Like the way that I see teaching is if you, if you are enthusiastic and you can motivate your students, so many of them have had all of their curiosity and motivation systematically beaten out of them by decades of public education. Like that's the, mo I felt like that was the most important thing that I could do for students and that would make them succeed is if, if I could simply make them like the subject again, instead of just blow their brains out, reading through, you know, fucking fact after fact. Like if, if anybody thinks that science is memorizing facts, then I am sorry that <laughs> the education system has failed you so badly. Yeah, and that's the other thing too. Uh, Shino Shinotic uh, says, I think people focus too much on the first level of content at school when the real learning experience will help you is second level. Problem solving, dealing with stress, dealing with schedule, managing expectation. There's so much good psychology research about how to have a good teaching experience, about how people actually learn. And the like lecture method of the teacher stands at the front and drones on and goes through the PowerPoints or whatever it is, is literally provably bad. Like for decades, people who have PhDs in education know that it's bad and it just takes so long for anything to change. It's so frustrating. Um, I took a, just like, Professors at universities don't have teaching degrees. Some of them have never taken a class or learned how to teach in their entire life. And that's, it's not their fault. The system is just like that. Like when I was first um, teaching, all of the, the, stu the grad students who taught, they had, it was literally like, oh, you took classes and now you're a grad student. Here, teach people. Like as if that, as if they're ever going to do well, just being told to just go teach. Like three years into my grad school program, they introduced a class to start trying to teach people how to teach. And so now you get one semester as a grad student of here's how to teach. But I mean, at least the person that I got from that, she was a, she was an education PhD. And like, it just blew my mind how much we know about how we should teach and how people actually teach. It's just a giant fucking chasm. Insane college prices are a big problem. Dude, yeah, because it's like you go through this shit experience and then you get a mountain of debt. Uh, I went through four years of university as a mechanical engineer, but as soon as I got a job, I didn't use anything I learned. It was all just being creative and finding new solutions to problems. Dude, exactly. It's, it's basically the same thing for science. It's basically the same thing for science, too. And those, are the sk like, those skills were not something that I ever learned in school anyway. <laughs> I was a bad student. <sighs> All this broken education system is breaking my heart. Well, I will say it's getting better. Like, I, for, for people who aren't, you know, in it or haven't been to a university lately or whatever, at least at the university level, it is getting better. Like, I know that, like, the, the you know, the woman who is my, um, who is my uh, scientific, science education teacher, the one who taught about, like, how to teach science, like they have, they're, they're slowly, you know, trying to make universities understand and to change stuff. And I know at my own university, they are implementing a lot of this stuff. It's just, you know, my summary of all human history is we do everything right eventually, but it takes way fucking longer than it should. And we drag our heels kicking and screaming the entire fucking way. So I really do think it is getting better. Uh, it's just, it's just fucking slow. Death by PowerPoint. <laughs> I mean, PowerPoint can be fine. Anything can be fine, but... <sighs> and elementary school is put in special education because of behavior issues. Why? Because it's an easy way of dealing with things. Oh, God, don't even get me started on, like... <laughs> people who don't fit the right mold for doing well in school. Clearly the problem's with you and not with the school. <laughs> God damn it, dude. <laughs> I'm an industrial welder and I feel you on that. I took the welding course at school and dropped out after needing to go to take things that don't matter. Yeah. 
Yeah, I changed my major three times, computer science, aerospace, not a physics, trying to figure out what I want to do. Well, that's the thing is how do you know what you want to do when what you're doing isn't what you're going to be doing when you actually graduate? That's the, that's the big disconnect for me. If you like taking science classes, that doesn't mean you're going to like working in a lab. That doesn't mean you're going to like writing science papers and doing research. Like, it, there's a giant disconnect between what you actually learn and what you actually do. I'm the most ADHD motherfucker on the face of the planet and struggle my way through school. But as soon as I got a job creating machines, my ADHD is a huge advantage. Dude, I feel like it's the exact same thing for me. Like, my I get bored so fast in classes, I just... It's the worst experience for me. But when I'm just like by myself in the lab and I can go down every fucking, you know, every fucking car box and follow every fucking car shiny that I want, then like it works extremely well for that. So that's the thing is, it's like what we really want society to do is to match people with the thing that works well for them. We don't want to take everybody and shove them into the same box. We want to find the box that fits everybody individually and that's just, i feel like that's the big disconnect between how education should be and how it is right now it's finding what works for each person and finding what they're good at rather than trying to tell them what they're good at and cram them all through the same system <laughs> and i hope i didn't make anybody too depressed i really do think it's getting better but i also feel like the more people talk about this stuff and the more people think about it then the faster it's gonna get better <sighs> So anyway, shout out, shout outs to all the teachers out there who actually give a shit. <laughs> Carl Mad. I believe, I believe, every day's a good day with pain. I believe, I believe, it'll bring a lot of good thoughts to your heart.